So uh, my mount is now on the way to Austria uh, for a upgrade or overhaul. I noticed that, uh, especially when you have direct driven mounts, uh, I saw an increase in the amp drawage uh, in the axis, which might be an indication that the bearings is uh, uh, had to be replaced. So I, during this winter, I activate the log function for the motors, and uh, well, it was quite clear that. Uh, the amps were ramping up during the exposures which led to my decision to send the mount back to Austria and have it uh, overhauled. So they are going to change the bearings, uh, overlook the internal um, uh, cables for the USB and power. Um, they are also going to take a look at uh, if it's possible to upgrade to USB 3. Uh, don't know if I need it anyway, but I asked them to, to just take a look if it's possible. What I want to talk about right now um, is how to mount uh, your mount onto a pier. I've seen a lot of guys out there using rat boxes. Uh, some of them is quite high, uh, maybe up to 20 centimeters of uh, threaded bolts. And maybe some just using three of them. Um, try to avoid these as much as you can. If you can't avoid them, try to keep the bolts as thick as possible, as short as possible, and probably more than just three to get that rat box as sturdy as it gets because you do not want to introduce uh, vibrations or anything. As you can see, uh, this bottom plate for the mount is bolted directly to this steel pier, which is attached to about one ton of concrete in the ground, reinforced concrete. So, And the mount itself goes onto this plate and is bolted down quite... Uh, quite tough so there's no uh, room for any vibrations or anything this is mounted flush to this plate so what you can do um, to avoid rat boxes um, some of you guys need to attach especially you guys which use EQR mounts or those mounts which is attached underneath with a bolt you can make a hole in the pier and also a hole on this side, so you can grab the screw from uh, the underneath the pier. If you have a concrete pier, this will be uh, tougher. But you can make a... Uh, it's quite popular to use disc brakes. Um, take two of them, bolt those two together, bolt one disc plate uh, directly to the mount, the other disc plate directly to the pier, and bolt those two uh, brake discs together. There's no, um, there's no gap between them, and it will be as sturdy as it gets. Um, so try to keep those rat boxes away from the equation, or just minimize the uh, thread rods um, in length. I don't know how long my mount will be on the way to Austria, or how long they will need, but the season uh, starts here late August or early September at the best for me so they have a couple of months to go uh, in the meantime i'm going to take a look at the uh, balance of my newton astrograph i'm going to show you guys uh, some solo photography i haven't done that before well i've done the photography but i haven't shown you that before so um, i believe this will be a quite interesting summer um, for me as well so stay tuned, I hope you like my videos. Uh, please hit the like button and the subscribe button. So uh, stay safe out there, bye.